people, my name is Galago, and welcome to a Black Friday haul. Woo! Not all this stuff was bought on Black Friday, but it was all kind of bought around Black Friday. So I'm just going to show you all of it, and yeah. So the first thing I'm going to show you is the new Loki. You guys might know that I have an Instagram based off of these. Um, if you didn't know that, then they just... The, the link will be down in the description. But yeah, I love these things. They're really cool because if you haven't heard of them, um, in this black dot is dirt from the Dead Sea. And then in the white one is water from the top of Mount Everest. So basically what it's saying is when you're on your lows, stay hopeful. And when you're on your highs, stay humble because these are the lowest and highest points on earth. So yeah, super cool. And then for everyone that you buy, they donate money to whatever cause it's for. Next thing I'm going to show you is what I got at GameStop, and I was really excited about this. Um, I'm not going to say I was disappointed, because I was really happy to just get one, but it was the Black Friday Mystery Box. And I saw these last year, and I was like, that is so cool, but I didn't see it until after Black Friday, and I was like, man, that, that's tragic. But I ended up getting one this year, and I'm not disappointed, I just don't really know the characters in it. This is what I got in it. Uh, but these are from Five Nights at Freddy's, and they're super cute, and I love them. Next up is, I honestly have not seen Suicide Squad yet. Um, I want to, but I just haven't seen it yet, so then I'll probably know who this is. But her name is Enchant Enchantress. Yeah, Enchantress. And it is a GameStop exclusive, came exclusively in the Black Friday box. So, I mean, it's really cool. I just don't know who she is. And last but not least is the actual pop figure. And this is Vegeta? I don't know how it's pronounced. Maybe it's Vegeta. I have I'm no idea because I don't know anything about Dragon Ball Z. Uh, but now that I have a pop figure, I'm going to kind of look into it so that I'll at least know, like, <laughs> what this is up with. Yeah, it would have been cool to have a character that I actually knew, but a whale. At least I got a box. I'm super happy about it. Alright, next up is Hot Topic, and this wasn't a Black Friday sale, I didn't go over there on Hot Top. I didn't go over to Hot Topic on Black Friday. I wish I had because they had this super cool golden BB-8 pop figure, and you guys might, may or may not know, I am obsessed with pop figures, you can probably tell, like I got the Funko box, and then what I'm about to show you, and I have like a whole pop collection, but I didn't know it was going to be there, so if I had known I would have gone and gotten one, but I didn't know. So first up is this beanie, and it's super cute, it's like a light gray, and then it has Stitch doing cartwheels on the front of it, and I absolutely love Stitch, so it's, it's really cute, and I wore it yesterday, and I really like it, and yeah. Next up is... Boom! It is the Hot Topic exclusive Flocked Doug, and I love Flocked ones. If you guys don't know what Flocked means, it means that they're kind of fuzzy. So he has like this fuzzy stuff on him, he's all fuzzy all over, and it's super cute! Alright, so next up on the list is Walmart, and I did go here on Black Friday, like at the opening, and it was absolutely insane. If you've never been to Walmart on Black Friday, basically what they do is they take the different items and they wrap them up in saran wrap and then they like tell you they're like all right it's six o'clock you can rip it so people just start shredding them and they're like pushing people out of the way trying to get to what they want it was there was like this lady that got pushed down it was just it was insane it wasn't where I was but it was like at this other thing she literally it was terrible it was just it was insane Black Friday is insane if you've never gone Black Friday shopping it's quite the experience so this is what I got from Walmart um this is just really basic but it is a charger for iPhone. Next off is this game. It's a Wii game. You can't see it right there because it has the red dot but it is a Wii game and it has all of the like classic Mario's on it and it looks super cool. Next up is I got a 2DS a little while ago. I didn't want it, the 3D. I didn't care about that but I wanted to be able to play the 3DS games so I finally got this game which is um Donkey Kong and I love Donkey Kong. It's the same as Mario where we had it on the Nintendo. It was Donkey Kong Country Original and I that's one of my favorite games so I was really excited to get this for the DS so yeah super exciting. And last but not least from Walmart is a Zelda game uh, for the 3DS. It's o Ocarina of Time, The Legend of Zelda 3. I don't know anything about Zelda but I've always wanted to play it. So I'm really excited to try this. Let me know what you guys think of Zelda overall or if you have any of these games that I'm showing you, uh, comment below and let me know what you think. 
Next up is Target, and I only got really one, well, I got two things technically, but one of them was like a fall item. It was like, um, hold on, I'll just, I'll just show it to you. So I got this from Target, and you might be like, what on earth is that? But this is like a super cute fall decoration that I was watching ever since it was full price. Like, boom, super happy. And next from Target is the, I got this DS game as well. I kind of just like <laughs> went crazy on the DS games. But this is um, Kirby Planet Robobot. I love Kirby. I love Kirby so much. On the GameCube, I used to play like Kirby Air Ride all the time. So Kirby is my little man and he is so cute. And this looks like it's a lot of fun. So I'm excited to play this. All right, next is going to be some clothes. Uh, this is from Banana Republic. Alrighty, so first off is this dress. Hold on. I got you for I'm at the top. I don't know if you can really tell, but at the top it's mesh like see-through kind of and then it gets to where you can't see through and it's just like that and it's 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 cute it has like um the patterns in it and then yeah there you go now you can kind of see how get an idea of what it looks like and then look at how cute the sleeves are they're like little puffy ones and uh, but they have like little ruffles they're just it's a really cute dress i don't know what color this is it's like i think it's like a peach or it's like a light pink and then it has lace at the top and at the bottom and it's really cute it has these little bows on the side next is this black sweater and it actually has some dog fur on it because i wore this on thanksgiving uh it is just a plain black sweater from an air public and it's made with fine italian yarn so it's like all super fancy and stuff but it's very sleek it's very soft and i love sweaters so love it next is this plain blue t-shirt it does have a little pocket right there which is cute and it's just really really soft i like just kind of neutral shirts that you can wear with stuff i have a lot of patterned shorts that i wear in the summer so it'll be cute with some of those and yeah i mean you can't go wrong with just a basic shirt and lastly from banana republic is this dress which I, okay, I didn't think this was going to fit me because it's like way smaller size than what I usually wear, but it was the last one. It was on the clearance rack and it ended up being like super cheap. I don't even remember how much. And so it kind of gathers here at the top, like that pattern, and then it flares out and it's all like, woo! So it's, it's cute and it's basic. I don't know what it is about these type dresses. It almost looks like a bridesmaid dress to me. But for some reason, I just really like it. And that's kind of like a gray slash khaki brown type color. So that's its unique color. All right, next is Old Navy. And I don't usually shop at Old Navy. Like, I haven't been in there in forever. But I wanted one of their puffer vests because I absolutely love those. I have one when I was like, it's like a kid size. So it's too small. And I was like, no. I um had to go get me an adult one because I'm an adult now. First thing, um, I guess, from Old Navy is the shirt like this sweater that I'm actually wearing right now. So it has just like the patterns on it for like the woo basic um, sweater. All right, next is this polka dotted button down shirt. So it's not buttoned up, so it's gonna look kind of weird. But anyways, it's just this button down polka dotted shirt. It has a little collar, has little rolled up sleeves that you can roll up. Oh, so cute. And it's a very thin material, like you can probably see through it right there. So it's, it's good for like fall slash springtime when it's not necessary like since it's black it's gonna soak in sun and then it's gonna be kind of warm but it's also since it's so thin for the winter you would be probably kind of cold but with like a sweater vest or something like that it'd be super cute the puffer vest that i ended up getting is this one Woo! there we go you see it has kind of like a um like a i don't know what to tell you it's a texture kind of like a texture to it and it has little pockets and it has like the fleece on the inside so it's really 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 soft it's really 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 warm and this thing is heavy like it's a really good quality which I was excited about Ooh, it is nice all right so next I got this flannel and uh, it's not buttoned up either but anyways it's a button-up it has the little collar and then it has the rolled up sleeves just like the polka dot one but it is like a flannel kind of material super cute I love flannels so I'm excited about this it has a little pocket too which I love when my shirts have pockets I got some pajamas and it's these where it has like the pattern in it because I really like that and yeah that's that's basically the top it's just like that and then the bottoms match so it's like the same material but just for the pants so woo! yay for winter pajamas they're so cozy gotta love them last but not least from Old Navy is 
drum roll please. I got this off the clearance rack because it is summer. Um, it's a summer item, but it's like a little sundress. Whoop. It's a little sundress, so it has like the little flare out, and then at the top it has, this is like the top, and then in the back it has the smocking. I don't know if you can really see that, but it has the smocking so that it's stretchy and it's like fitted, and then it's just like this little cute flower pattern, but this dress, it's so light and flowy that when you're wearing it and you like spin around, it's one of those that like spins really well, and it's just kind of like, woo. Well, all right, I guess that is it for this haul. Comment down below and let me know if you went Black Friday shopping, what you got. Make sure to leave a like if you did enjoy this. <laughs> Sub if you aren't already uh, so that you'll know when new videos come out because I am kind of sporadic with it. And I will see you next time, fam. Love you. Bye.